no hi guys welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to be showing you guys what i pack up for school yeah i'm in a boarding school so i'm going to show you guys what i pack up for boarding school and then i'm going to tell you what it feels like to be a student in an average nigerian boarding school like is that easy so without wasting your time let's get right into the video so i already have my box here this is the box i used to go to school it's not quite big but it's just medium size so i already have the stuff that i want to put into my box here arranged here i've ironed out all my uniforms because of course my school wear uniforms so i don't really have much clothes to carry i've ironed them and i've folded them i have my inner bag ready and i have um, other few things that um i take to school or more like i put in my box because i put my books in my school bag yeah so it's more of like my clothes and other little things that i put in my box are here so i like to arrange them out so i don't miss anything out when i'm packing so i just taking out what um i used to go to school or what i'm meant to go to school with and i've arranged it and then i brought my box so that i can put it inside the box so okay yeah in my box i have these babies but these babies I ain't going to school nope school is a no-no if i take this to school it's either it's going to get stolen it's going to get seized or it's going to get spoiled and that is not what i want my babies because this this shoe is still new like someone gives them to me but i like to keep it in my box because i don't want it in the open i guess i don't know but i just like to keep it in my box because these babies are not going to school all right first of all i have my innerwear bag in here i have um, most of my innerwears and socks my school socks and my sleeping socks because at night it's cold in school so I sleep with my socks on but I'm not going to show you guys what is in here because it's just weird showing me my inner hair so I'm not going to do that yeah I'm not too weird yeah this I put them in this bag and I like the bag because it's small it has pink on it and it says baby pool I don't know if you guys can see it but it says baby pool and it's cute and I've been using it for about like two years right now yeah I think two years yeah two years yeah and it's still serving its purpose so I just put it in my box so that is it for my inner ways I don't take much to school because taking much to school means coming back with less and I don't have that much money to spend on inner ways so <laughs> no I don't take much to school then I have this top yeah this is like this is a shirt that I got from attending a leadership workshop in Abuja last year. The workshop was meant for prefects and I was among the selected few that went for this workshop. It's more of like an anti-corruption workshop. Yeah, like Kajem Young kind of workshop. And it says I am an accountability ambassador at the back of the shirt and this is how it looks and the workshop is organized by Luke's Terra Leadership Foundation I'm sure you guys know it yeah it's quite popular and then I have this white turtle neck I don't always carry this to school because I don't want to but since this is Hamatan season and it's kind of cold out there and I need to be protected and my school cardigan doesn't do that much so i'm taking this white um turtleneck i got it like a year ago or something so i'm taking it this time around because i've cold and then my uniforms this is my check more of like a day wear this is what we wear after um our classes when we have nothing more of like when we're not in class and when it's not um sports or something like this is like a day we i'm sure you guys know that you know what day we is let me not bore you guys with explanation i would have unfolded but i don't want to like damage it i have already ironed it and it's a lot of work that i've 
put into ironing it so I don't want to unfold it and then this this is one of our special ways to yeah yeah I just know what to call this but it's like one of our special ways and then this is my symbol of leadership yep this is my beret my prefectship beret my prefect in school so all prefects in my school wear a beret to show that you are prefect and then this is my uniform you can see it matches the color of my beret and then like my school in absence <laughs> our uniform and our beret are of the same color dark blue this is what i wear for classes and then this is a sports skirt yeah my school wears shorts or skirts but i like to wear skirts because i don't like shorts for pe or sports so this is skirts and actually i made this one i did not made i took it to a tailor to save for me at home it's not like from the school here goes my Sunday skirt. This is what I wear on Sundays throughout. Yeah, this is what we wear on Sundays throughout. Yeah, it's light blue skirt. And I like it. It's like one of my best uniforms. Like, I love my Sunday wear. This is a skirt and it comes with a top. Yeah, this is a Sunday skirt. So, this is my light wear. I wear this to sleep. Right. And moving on from clothes, um, let me take you guys to other things that I like to keep in. Um, these are my tags. This is my profession tag. My profession tag. This is a tag that I got from attending the leadership workshop that I told you guys about earlier. Okay, my alarm clock. It's pink and cute. Yeah, this is the alarm I use for timing myself waking up and all that okay alarm clock necessary and since it's covid19 era i have my face max with me this is light blue i have a dark blue um face max but it's not here i need to put it later on and the logo of my school is on here to use me i go to a little fat my first so i do not i stay for me so yeah this is a face max that they gave us it's customized and then skin yeah 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 even though it's a boarding school you still need to take good care of your skin yep so i use media nourishing cocoa lotion yeah it's body lotion and it has deep moisture serum Cocoa. I like anything that has to do with cocoa. I feel like it's good for my skin. That's why I use Nivea cocoa. I never leave for school without my first thing. It's essential for me. Then I have this shea butter. It's 100% organic, unrefined shea butter. I use it for my skin and my hair because shea butter is nice for your skin and your hair 100% organic unrefined and I never really use that much this is a new this is like a new um container that I got and then I have a few books because I mostly put my books in my school bag so that my school box is not too heavy for me to drag so I'm just gonna put like just this much um, books in my book and I have my padlock and key if you are in a boarding school if you went to a boarding school you know why padlock and keys are very essential because man like we got like highway arm drivers in there you need to lock up because you're going to lose all you have look everything like anything can be stolen in boarding school even yourself you need to lock up yourself I have this pair of slippers that I'm gonna wear in my gown because obviously not going to work barefooted so I bought these slippers I'm just gonna put it here and then last but not least I have this my bible like anywhere you're going to meet God anywhere in my school we have scary stories about witches and all that so 
you gotta protect yourself like 100 percent with god the word of god is essential in life my blankets yeah i like to put my blanket on top of my box like this now that i'm done packing my box let's talk about what an average nigerian body school life is like okay all that stuff it's like university you're your own like you have to make the right choices for yourself in everyday life wake up at 4 30 4 30 a.m in the morning mostly you don't wake up to the sound of like cool ocean music or something you wake up to the sound of a bell an annoying bell so moving on wake up 4 30 arrange your bed arrange your corner arrange your bunk arrange everything that needs to be arranged make sure your corner is in good shape for you leave. you go you take a shower you dress up you go for mass in your school your school is a catholic mission school so you go for mass every single day we don't have cleaners we don't have nannies because no nope, we're gonna do our work by ourselves so we go we have um potions we call it potions in my school like a particular area where i'm meant to walk yeah we go for class mind you we haven't eaten breakfast yet, like all these activities that are empty stomach, we haven't eaten breakfast. The food is so small that a baby, a feeding baby would eat and ask for more. Like I'm, I am not exaggerating, I'm so serious. And I think the most annoying part of boarding school is that you don't get to like, you don't get, you can't really arrange your routine. It's like you need every single day doing the same thing over and over again for months. It can be quite frustrating. So more or less, like body school life is more of being independent. Yeah, it can be fun too. There are a lot of fun stuff in body school. Like you get to live life with, like you get to live every day. You you grow with your classmates. You guys go through a lot together. You have to make sure people don't control your mind. Like that is not. You're going to get lots and lots of regrets and bonus. That is all for this video. Thank you guys so so much for clicking on this video. If you're subscribed, thank you. If you're not subscribed, please make sure to hit that subscribe button. Thank you guys for all the love you showed to me. And let me know if you want me to do more videos like this about boarding school because I am quite experienced. That is it. I'll see you guys in my next video.